everybody and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I wanted to give you a little bit of a barn update. So this is only going to be a little video and a quick look around where we're up to now. And I will probably do a voiceover only because I'm sat here and I am looking at the barn door and there are workmen there again. <laughs> and there is just, I just do not have the confidence to walk around the barn and talk to the camera while there are people in there working. Um, it's also absolutely peeing it down so I'm completely soaked but I really wanted to film this video today because I have a feeling that the next few weeks of work is going to really change how the barn is looking. So I wanted to quickly document today before too much other exciting stuff happens. Oh no, people going past. <laughs> It's so embarrassing when people go past and they think I'm talking to myself. Um, yeah, so today I really wanted to make sure I got over here and filmed because I just want to kind of note the process and have a like have a series of videos to look back on and think, oh yeah, that's what that looked like at that stage and all that sort of thing. So that is what I thought we would do today. Have a quick look around, see what's happening. There has been like... I can see from here that there's been things that have changed since I was here, la here last time. So I'm actually really excited to look at the new stuff that's been done as well. I'm going to take some pictures and yeah, just keep a log of what's happening because it's all happening so quick now. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Sorry, I do look like a little bit of a drowned rat right now because I did just get caught in the rain. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you like the update and I hope filming and then doing a voiceover is okay for you guys um, because yeah, it's wait. I don't know if any of you have ever tried talking to a camera in front of people, but it's flipping embarrassing. And I haven't had the most practice over the last few months. So I'm trying to get back in the swing of it. I'm also filming this on my phone. So I hope that that's okay. And I, I'm looking at the qualities I'm filming. I hope the quality is okay. Cause I know that if I had my camera, it would be so much better, but my camera is off being repaired at the minute. So there's not a lot we can do about it. So here I am doing what I can with what I have. The baby is with me so you can hear the baby talking, but let's just, I'm going to stop rambling because I've been talking for like two and a half minutes and you guys are just here for the updates. So let's get straight into the video. So we are starting the tour looking in the office. So as you can see now, they have started putting in the windows and the doors and this has completely changed the look of this building. It looks completely different. So then if you look to the right, we go straight into the living room. As you can see, pretty much everything is done in this room. Uh, everything's plastered, the ceiling's done, the windows are in, window sills, the door is in. It's pretty much just at a point of tidying up. And obviously we've got all the materials from the other bits of the house, which are still sort of undergoing works and stuff in there. Um, but other than that, the actual basis of the room is pretty much done. I just love the beams in here. Um, this is one of the doors, which leads to the outside. As you can see, it's this um, white color at the minute, but we will be painting it. But every time I see the white, I'm like, oh, it actually looks quite nice. Um, and then this is just a look of the other side of the room as you can see there's the troughs and feeding things that were in there from the beginning which have which have been left and now we're looking at the downstairs bathroom so smurf has started tiling and as you can see we went with these bright bluey turquoisey moroccan style tiles just because i think we fancied something a little bit more statement and different and then this door takes you through into the kitchen. So as I was there filming this, they were ripping out those big barn doors ready to put in the patio doors that are gonna go to the outside. But yes, the window, oh my God, it's like completely changed the space. It's just made it so much lighter. So in here has still got a lot of work to go. The insulation is in, but it needs um, that boarding putting up and it needs the plastering and all. It, it's got quite a lot to do still in this room um but all the underfloor heating and the floors and everything is all done it's just yeah doing those little the walls and all the final bits so this is the hallway um this door i did show you because that's one of the original doors that was in the barn when we bought it and then smurf cut it down into a little door and um, which i thought was really nice and that's all the heating and everything under the stairs and then this is one of the bedrooms so as you can see this room is pretty much finished like all the v-luxes are in it's even painted the only thing we've got to do is fill in the gap um as you can see on the top of the beam there that needs filling in at some point but this room 
is finished. Like it's got a door, skirting board, it's painted. Yeah, and then we go onto the landing. This is the main bathroom. This is pretty much done as well in terms of it's plastered. It has a window, it needs painting, and then it needs tiling and the suite fitting. But other than that, it's completely done. So then, um, oh, I think, oh yeah, I'm showing you another look of where the shower's going. <laughs> um, but obviously nothing else is fitted as of yet. So it looks not done, but the room itself is pretty much done. So this is our bedroom. You can see this beam is just absolutely stunning. And I'm not sure whether the steps were in in the last video, but these little steps that Smurf made go straight into our ensuite and then the ensuite itself goes into our walk-in wardrobe. So this is the ensuite. Again, it's pretty much done. We're just getting on to like the part where it's putting the tiles on and then fitting the suite. This is the uh, dressing room ward walk-in wardrobe type place. So this we will have a built-in wardrobe in here at some point but I think when we first move in it'll just be rails of clothes and like a clothing storage but look how pretty the floorboards look we're going to be keeping those because I, I just don't want carpet <laughs> and then this is another look at our bedroom from the other end and just at how spectacular that flipping beam is it's beautiful this is the last bedroom Again, pretty much finished. It just needs it, that window putting in at the end. And then this room is done. Radiators are on. I don't know if you noticed in the other rooms, but the radiators are on in all the rooms upstairs. And then we've got underfloor heating downstairs. So this is the only part which is really sort of not near done. So this is a single story part of the house. The floors have been brought up. The underfloor heating has been put in the original bricks have been laid back down and then they are going then well now they are starting on the roof so the roof is off so that's why obviously it's wet so this is the next bit that they are going to be cracking on with because it's definitely not not livable at the minute <laughs> so i have literally just got absolutely soaked looking around there sorry i'm checking that nobody's to me while I talk. Um, I just got absolutely soaked but I hope you enjoyed that little glimpse of where we're up to so far and how much things have changed because literally things have just seemed to change really quickly all of a sudden. I have a feeling I'm gonna have to go any second. Um, so I'm gonna wrap this up really quickly. I've just come to the kitchen place to finalize a few things with the kitchen and then hopefully that'll be going in in July. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching. I've gotta go, <laughs> she's about to cry. Um, thank you so much for watching and I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Bye.